Powers Bajo Mecha And more This is Stamos and to me Hello guys and welcome back to our Stores Figure Review F4 Day Stores Figure Review. We're going to take a look at 2012's Movie Heroes, Padme Queen, Padme Queen Amadala. however you want to call me, Padme Amadala. Um, I got this one not so long ago, loose, bought some figures loose and this one was one of them. Real cool figure, uh, I was meaning to get it in the stores but then I saw someone sold this one loose for a lot cheaper. And I didn't really need the card back, so I just got her loose. But very nice figure, uh, nonetheless. So, like I said before, no card back, but I can show the accessories. She does come with, um, you get this Galactic Bell Game card, uh, which is, has a nice picture of her. So, you have that. She also came with the dice, but I'm not gonna show that. She also has the, um, you know, the figure stand. And she ha has this backpack kind of thing uh, with a rope attached and a handle thing. I don't know what purpose this has, but it's kind of stupid. It's uh, like a kid's feature again, but not needed, not ne uh, necessary here. Um, and the figure itself comes with a blaster, which is her own blaster, which has some nice detailing. Pretty good. Um, figure... Yeah, the likeness is pretty decent, not too bad, but also not great. Um, they are never good at making or creating a good female likeness anyway, so this is definitely one of the, one of, uh, of the bad ones again. So, you do have that. We got the hair in the back, which that is nicely done though. So, we do have that. You got this big hole in the back. It's for the backpack, uh, for the kids feature thing. So you have that, and then you got our clothes, which is very dark purple, a bit light purple here on the on the you know, forearms. So you have that, and you got those gold, as you can see, those gold um, whatever that is, kind of stripes on her tunic, and you also have that on the back, as you can see here, and also in the lower part on the skirt or whatever. So that's nice. And she also has your silver bell buckle, so you do have that. The rest is kind of generic, it's just everything is dark purple. Nothing special here, but it's still nice to have. Um, articulation wise, kind of decent, kind of not. Art uh, ball joint head, she has swivel shoulders, which is bad. She has ball hinged wrists, though, but she does, uh, ball hinged elbows, but she does not have an articulation point in the wrist, which is really weird. Uh, her gun is always pointing in some weird angle, when they're in a weird direction, I don't know what's it, but that looks really bad. He had a swivel in the hip area here, or in the body, torso, whatever. Uh, again, swivel hips here. And there's no articulation from then. So there's no articulation in the knee or the ankle whatsoever, so that's pretty bad. But, overall, she still can stand, she's still a good figure. It's nice to have her, and if you're a Padme fan, you definitely have to pick her up. So, um, that's about it for this review, and I hope you guys enjoyed. We'll be back with some more reviews very soon, so until then, keep collecting, and may the force be with you. Bye.